Welcome to Glowing Hour. Today we are drinking a what is this called? Rosemary Mescal Rosemary Fizz. Mescal Fizz. A little different, a little fall. It's not looking like fall if you're watching. But listen, we're getting there. It's just California. It's California. She's a little slow. She's catching up, hopefully. It was 71 degrees this morning on my walk. Okay, cold. <laughs> Okay, freezing. Okay, cloudy. <laughs> Let's see what this is all about. Wow. What? <laughs> That's a crazy flavor. I don't even know how to describe this, to be honest. I mean, mezcal, you're going to get mezcal regardless. I know why we put the salt in there. It tastes good. <laughs> it tastes okay, good. This tastes like actually something like I would get at a bar. Like, you would order the mezcal drink, and this is it. Oh, oh, I see what you're saying. Like, this is their special. Yeah. Hmm. I like that. I think a taller glass with more club soda would be, like, more sippable. More sippable. But... This I'm downing fast. Right. Which is dangerous. So, I'd say... Good club drink. Do... Yes. <laughs> do a taller glass with more club soda if you're trying to do a, like, just And maybe more chill. ice. Yeah. I mean, I don't even think we did ice. Can you taste the rosemary? No. The mezcal is just so She's strong. strong. Maybe we didn't release the oils properly. <laughs> Maybe smoke your glass. I mean, Make it more smoky, more. My tongue's a little numb in a weird way. Like, it's not physically numb, but it just, like, I got a mouthfeel for the mezcal. And it's just like, mm. <laughs> I can't. Who knows? I'm not a connoisseur, okay? <laughs> all right. Well, today is a little fun one for us all. I got to drink up so I can come up with really funny answers. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm funny without alcohol. I'm funny without alcohol. Oh my God. Good time. Don't think of me like that. <laughs> I have six currently and then I might have to come up with some out of the noggin. Some, yeah. Okay. Well, okay. T- today, essentially, we... Oh, I'm like, uh, explain it. <laughs> we are like quizzing each other a little bit. Not really. It's just like... It's not a competition. It's not... It's just like... <laughs> it's just... I'm like, no, we're not competing. We're not competing. Um you'll see it's fun questions and hopefully it'll help you like get to know us if you haven't listened to us talk for like a hundred hours because we have like a hundred hours worth of content yep if you still feel like you don't know enough know enough right or our dynamic or you just want to laugh also yeah you know what speaking on the dynamic I just, I got a a bone to pick with someone in the comments. Why? (laughs) Well, I sent this to you. Someone commented like, oh my God, like you guys lack any chemistry together. Just stop podcasting. And I was like, honestly, suck my dick. We're probably talking about the most sad topic ever. I'm like literally crying in the episode. Right. Like, oh, I'm sorry. We don't fucking make you laugh and feel all fucking fuzzy inside. It was literally probably a man too. It was a woman, which makes it worse. Fuck you, bitch. Literally. I'm like, like a man, I'm like, whatever. He doesn't get it. But a woman, I'm like, you're supposed to get it. (laughs) Sorry that you don't get it. It is what it is. Grind my gears once or twice. I also just think that that's like, like, why comment You're really specific, girl. Like, why are you being so weird? Like, stop watching. Clearly, you watch enough to think that we don't have chemistry. So, like, tune out. Also stop podcasting girl it's too late for us it's too late <laughs> we're in fucking it. too into this now i am a podcaster it is by it is. hobby <laughs> <laughs> trying to be by trade, by trade yes <laughs> uh, okay here's our first question we each have to answer it <clears throat> if someone told you they saw me at a random location in the middle of the night where would you immediately assume that i was okay do we have like a second to answer like do we have a little or is it like gut i think i need a a little second okay a little second (laughs) (laughs) i mean this one we've said and i already said an answer should i stay your answer okay my answer was tenants of the trees (laughs) so fucking rude i mean like why that though the middle of the night like where else are you gonna be in the middle of the night fair enough tenants fun i don't okay i don't know if this is my answer because you said that okay but i was gonna say like downtown fullerton fuck you like at the matador 
hate you. Dude, so we I went recently um for sarah's birthday shout out sarah if you're listening and it's just funny i felt so old i was like it's loud in here people are touching yeah i'm not enjoying this experience i mean i'm having fun because i'm here for my friends yeah but like the idea of going every weekend or even once a month even twice Exhausting. a year. Exhausting. <laughs> twice a year. This it's not, is not it's it. It's like it's fun, but it's not that fun, dude. And it's not even that I don't like the music or like, I mean, I didn't like the people. I was going to say, is it like, the crowd? Yeah, the crowd. The not crowd. the people I'm with. Of course not. But like the, the fucking 40 year old men trying to get at 21 year olds. Like a man disgusting. literally put his hands around my waist. And I was like, hell It's literally whoa. like the rich guys of like your Belinda. Yes. Yeah, literally going no. to downtown for Anaheim, Lichen. Santa Ana, that vicinity. That vicinity. Maybe even Laguna. I don't know. It's like their wives at home don't know. Stop. Or they're on the like, girls' Stop. trip. They go there. You're lying. I Why'd you have to go there? Back? I literally can see the, the Ew, people. I'm no, about. I'm thinking. So one of the people in particular, like, he was single because he's a dog. Like, I could just tell. Like, he's a. He. How do you know, though? I feel like so, some okay. men are just dogs. Let me just, let's go on a tangent. Let me tell you a little story. <laughs> so, so okay so he i'm like six foot three in my heels right <laughs> i'm the tallest woman in the building absolutely and like the only reason i'm not the tallest person in the building is because one of the people i was with he was six foot four right like is my her friend's fiance and he he even was like you're really tall <laughs> how tall are you without those heels <laughs> So whatever, I'm clearly making a fucking spectacle out of myself, apparently, and uh, just walking around, dancing, hanging out, and I like this group of guys just is like lingering next to our group, and it's annoying, and he, he's like clearly drunk. This guy comes up to me and he goes, "Hey," <laughs> like hello, and he's like, "I just wanted to say like your height, like that's sick or something," what? and I was like, "For sure, thanks." I'm like you know wearing heels and he's like yeah but like incredible and i was like cool i'm five foot eleven without heels so like like trying to be like please go away i can tell you're like five foot seven please stop talking to me i'm hunched down to speak to you right now okay (laughs) and like that's not even to be a bitch like if he had been a nice guy who was like the fiance genuinely being like dude you're tall that's sick no. I don't, it was just different maybe because i knew him like he was someone i was with, with yeah physically anyways so that happens next we're dancing it, a better song comes on i'm probably giving a little more to my movement i don't know and i'm not even the way like, you're describing it they'll give a little more <laughs> Like, let's just say he shook some ass i didn't though oh. that's the thing i wasn't just even a shaking li- just like, a little <laughs> like a little more like was not shaking ass was not throwing it at anyone you know I was not expecting anyone to catch it. Right. So I'm barely dancing. Maybe a little more movement from the side to side perspective. And I can tell out of the corner of my eye, this group of dudes is like watching. Like they have their arms crossed and they're both nodding their heads like this. Like they're not in a circle anymore. They're in a wall watching us. And I was like, okay, we're going to disregard because I'm having a good time. Like literally. And then all of a sudden I feel his hands come around my waist and I was like, I turned around like so uncomfortable. Like, wha- yes, like you spoke to me uh, 10 minutes ago. Doesn't mean you could put your fucking hands on me. And he's like, you know, most men would be intimidated. And I was like, what? oh, here we fucking go. What? And I love Sarah. I fucking love Sarah. She She's a short, short girly. She had heels on, <laughs> really high heels. <laughs> and she came in between us and was like, excuse me, like get your hands off. And I was like, period, Sarah, my fucking queen and savior right now. Because I'm the type of bitch to go into fucking do nothing mode. Like, just appease and smile and mm-hmm, I'm uncomfortable smile. Like, what's going on? Looking around. That's me. That's how I react in those situations. You'll just, like, physically try to remove yourself. But yes. you won't say anything. Yeah, I won't be like, what the fuck is your problem? Why are you touching me? Because that's just not my go-to. I wish it was. Maybe you should start practicing that. Maybe I should. Because it's not okay that people just put their hands on you. So it gets worse. <laughs> God damn it. Okay. I mean, subjective. So Sarah's like, she's engaged, which like I wear a basic gold band on my ring finger. Period. Just out of like you convenience, to be quite honest. I And now I'm like, period, that is my engagement ring. Yeah. And I was like, yeah, <laughs> whatever. And then his friend 
not as drunk but still drunk is going i'm so sorry i'm so sorry and i'm like then why aren't you interjecting getting your fucking friend's hands off of me and saying bro that's not cool but instead you're just looking at me going i'm sorry sorry like Like, are you fucking are you stupid i'm just like why are men cool with making women uncomfortable i don't think they think about it that way and that's the problem it's like if one of your dudes was uncomfortable you would want to fucking throw a fucking fist literally you would burn the place down you would literally make it a scene so many guys got kicked out of that bar too and we were at the exit and so i'm just looking at these dudes and they're like <laughs> <laughs> fucking idiots. anyways that tangent ugh, men just piss me off anyway yeah. back to being at the club yeah i would have yeah I think if you guys don't know what tenants of the trees it's a club i feel like if you didn't tell me if you didn't tell me like that you were gonna go out randomly checked your shit one night in the middle of like literally two you think I'd, i think you'd like be out you think i'd be out or you'd be like at jack in the box i'm never at jack in the box at two in the morning <laughs> i don't know where else are you gonna be in the middle of the night besides home i mean home i don't know i mean like yeah if you weren't out you'd be home yeah we're not like we're on not a rant, like a weekday especially i would expect you to be home at two in the morning yeah and if not i'm at tenants for some reason <laughs> for whatever fucking you know what reason you know? i was crazy that night yeah okay if someone told you i had gone viral on tiktok overnight <sighs> what would you assume i was go- doing in the video something with logan okay you de- it definitely would be like, like a couple thing a couple thing got it that's what i would foresee I'm trying to think about you. I feel like it would be like, it has to be like a baking video. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Of some sort. For, for the amount that I put out, one of them's got to go. One of them's got to go. <laughs> one of them's got to hit, right? Yeah. Fair. For this, also this phase of your life right now. You know, <laughs> the, single, the, the single, single era, era is over. Be different. But like what? I'm just curious. I, the things that did go viral. The thing, <laughs> <laughs> the thing of getting cheated on. Roasting your fucking ex. That was for good. cheating on you next one if aliens visited earth and you're and i was the only <laughs> human they encountered what would their thoughts on the human race be <laughs> Why is this one so bad? okay listen <laughs> i'm scared no no it's just funny i mean for number one we just came off the depression episode (laughs) i didn't even swallow yet (laughs) that's what she said (laughs) okay they encountered you but like you wouldn't be giving like like are we divulging our whole lives to these aliens like i mean let's pretend okay let's pretend they know you as much as i know you they like asked me about everything they'd be like god the human experience is rough (laughs) they'd be like this is i like being an alien right but not because your experience hasn't been great because of course experience has been great but i think there's just so much like the way that i described it is probably like fuck they'd be like all at once (laughs) <laughs> you were 18 all at once that was happening or like 21 you'd be like yeah, yeah. and they'd be like okay right that's okay it's true what else are they gonna know there would also be like this cool aspect though they'd be like that's kind of beautiful though like the struggle in the pain i'm serious yeah because like you see you see the struggle in the pain and you'd probably explain it in that way you'd be like you know what but that's life but you look at me now <laughs> look at me now but look at me now <laughs> they're like what am i looking at <laughs> they're like girl we got planes and shit that fly hey, w- look at you what look at you got a dog and a nice <laughs> nice job girl no but seriously i mean i don't know shit about aliens also i know they're a hot topic right now they're a hot topic maybe what? we should talk about them a little bit <laughs> in another episode i don't know maybe we should do a deep deep dive deep dive on aliens we care a lot about episode about (laughs) about episodes about aliens we care a lot about aliens episode what i feel like there would be more than just that i mean they i feel like they meet any human and they're like why are y'all doing all that i was gonna say like a little aspect of you that they'd probably be like be like that humans think too much they're like think less literally it's not that difficult 
you know that's me yeah think less think less that's what they would say to me huh yeah they'd be like why are you thinking so much and you'd be like i can't stop i literally can't that'd be their impression though like literally like why do y'all do do that too much <laughs> go same, go listen to the vibes. inner monologue episode okay aliens aliens just check out our podcast <laughs> tune in every week to get the human experience (laughs) definitely listen to two girls in their (laughs) mid-20s that's a human experience it really is it's you know we're probably gonna go into this in our 30s so just stay tuned (laughs) honestly yeah oh my god crazy what if we have like children i mean like that's kind of the goal eventually but like crazy to think about right now crazy to think about hi kids (laughs) hi children okay oh no this one's a little crazy and i hope you don't say what i think you're gonna say oh god if someone told you i was arrested without giving any additional explanation (laughs) what's the first assumption you would make about and why don't you fucking dare i think i know what you don't want me to say (laughs) i think okay you were arrested i feel like you probably fought someone fought just like fought someone at a bar Mm. because they were they deserved it for sure right they did, but yeah, you fought him. Got that was it. it. Maybe like a little drunk tank. You're not arrested. They're just like, put her in for a little. Put her in the drunk tank. She'll be fine. She'll be fine. Yeah. I think for you, you would. I can't even think of anything. <laughs> be arrested for like getting involved with a like murder case. Like you're not like you're not I was. The murderer, but I became like, the suspect because I was too interested. Yeah. Like, you were Googling too many things. You were listening to too many podcasts. Okay, I see. And then somehow... Somehow they're just like... Just my luck. Why is she so interested? Yeah. Or because you're not giving them the information you found. Mm-hmm. I'm holding back. I'm withholding they're information. They're like, this bitch is an accomplice. I don't know. I could see that. I could see that. I mean, do I want to see that actually? No. no but that is why you're going to jail. Okay. In this scenario. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for my Miranda rights. <laughs> Okay, to get a little more sentimental. What's something you know I would do for you in a heartbeat that no other friend would? Oh my God. I have to like low-key roast my other friends. <laughs> <laughs> it could be something that they would do too. It's okay. I don't, I don't, it's ex- okay. I don't expect that to be like... Um, let me think. I feel like you would like go on a fucking vacation for my birthday. Period. I just feel like it's not required. <laughs> it's like it's true it's so extra it is a little extra but you would would do do it it. you would do it but i don't expect it from anyone (laughs) (laughs) it's a lot it's a lot it is i feel like you would you would plan something from like literally like start to butt and like butt end Mm. yeah like any type of event i would build it off like a pinterest idea or one one conversation and 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 you would like take full charge period i don't think any other friend i think would do that i think logan might do that but i think she would still need some friend come on right but i think she would still sometimes need some like help in some regards on some Mm. things i feel like you would like you wouldn't second guess it you'd just be like even if she doesn't like it i think she likes it i'm like she's gonna pretend (laughs) but then Um, i'd probably like it you know I yeah. don't think there's anything that you would. I w- if I was questionable, I, like. I would be like, ah, all right, let's not do it then. Let's just let's, let's just go back to this idea. Yeah, go back to the other idea. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Why are you laughing? What is this one? If we were both contestants on a reality show like Love Island, who would get voted off first and oh. why? <laughs> <laughs> our dream, <laughs> our fucking dream. Literally, we would live to be on Love Island. I mean, actually, I'd hate it, but like. Mm-hmm. I think in my dream world, it's a dream. It's a dream. I think I would get voted off first. <laughs> Let's and just why, say it. And why? I think because I sometimes, like, I don't even want to say sometimes, most times, can't keep my mouth shut. But like, if I eat up the drama, they keep the drama. Yeah, but if it's too much, it's, I, like, you think I'll be kept be for much? another two episodes. Like, why though? Because you're saying too much? Like, you're in other people's business? I think the same reason that I would be voted off might be why you would be voted off. Not because, like, the opposite end of, like, you, you're you too kind. Like, I'm receiving the criticism. That you would just be, like... I'd be, like, all right, I'm guys. so sorry. Like, yeah. <sighs> Boring. 
not boring but just like you're not creating drama and maybe i'm creating too much drama but like Like if i'm on reality tv i'm kind of kicking it up up a little yeah Yeah. i think that's why i would also probably get because i would play it up but if we were on it together i don't think we'd get kicked off no like if we're on the same season game over could you imagine us like oh my god could we win like could they do like a best friends love island (gasps) oh What would that be? I guess that's like Big Brother or something. I don't know what Big Brother even is, to be honest. Neither. I think it's just one person wins, though. <laughs> All right. Friendship Love Island. Wait, yeah, why don't they make like reality TV shows about friends? Yeah, that'd be cute. Well, because they all end up being friends. You know what I mean? They're like, oh my God, that's we made true. such a unit here. We love you. We, we love can't believe you. we got voted off tonight. This is more like a daydreaming question. If we could go. Daydreaming? A- yeah. If we could go on a two week vacation together next summer with all expenses paid for where should we go and what would we do i mean we already had that planned kind of i want to go to europe you know how we all like last year we we're like mood board italian summer yes and then everyone had an italian summer but us well we had like a party <laughs> and we did <laughs> we tried to bring the italian summer home we did we did um would that be our thing i w- i would i would was I would gonna say, say so. europe for yeah. two weeks all expenses paid delightful boom easy Can someone question make it happen? <laughs> please and thank you <laughs> just kidding we're gonna girl boss our way into it yeah great <laughs> yeah <laughs> okay if you could relive any single day of our memories what would it be and why we have to do the why yeah I just, I was going to say something that's not podcast friendly. Oh, you could say when we were chasing the bio, bioluminescent waves. <laughs> that was multiple days. That was multiple days. <laughs> we didn't get, we didn't get to do that never saw one memory. Nope, never saw them. Wait, memory like it has to be a day or like, or like a time. Coachella. The first Coachella. The first Coachella. I would relive that. That was so fun. That was really fun. That was a good one. It felt like my first Coachella again. You're welcome. It was, I was bringing yeah, the energy. You. <laughs> I just, I, the artists were really good that year. They were. They were giving. Because like that first day was bliss, you know. Second day, <laughs> Minus the period and the, the, the bloody toes. The toe. You, you can know, forget all that, you know. It's really fucked up that I'm on my period at Coachella. Me too. Can that change? Can they? <laughs> just gonna skip it or something. There's wanted. like that this is sponsored by no <laughs> there's that brand that like that helps you skip yeah mm. they like sell birth control but they also help you skip a period a period if you need to what that can't be good but like also but also for the vibes i do a lot of things that aren't good for me <laughs> so what's the difference You're right like too many to count <laughs> <laughs> honestly if i could re like to relive one again mm-hmm. it's probably just like one of those days that we had to stay really late for your class in college oh my god and we had to just like sit at the at the yeah. pub the school yeah. pub like just eating our Why am fucking I gonna cry? food and just hanging out and talking <laughs> listening to like that reggae band that came out one time that man he was my favorite we should we should go back to that date <laughs> yeah but something like that oh, I those were say. the best just i don't know why i forgot bliss. about college i was like yeah <laughs> i'm like the first time we went to a party together <laughs> oh my god no. let's relive let's not re- our first and only frat party the way i can't like i didn't even get that drunk i don't think but the way i can't remember how no I we s- must have been okay. we must have been you know we brought coffee cups of alcohol where did those coffee cups go we threw them away <laughs> whose were they i, I don't, don't remember Victoria, i don't know where they maybe? went i don't know uh that would be funny to relive but also disgusting i'd be like what are you doing here i'm like Mm, let's go to fucking del taco instead and which we, we did, did. <laughs> <laughs> that's a no okay but the pub like one of our last days of school when our friend river shout out river, shout out river. bought us drinks because we were finally t- yeah we were, we're finally, finally 21. 21 had a little glass of rose or some shit it was a good time that was just wow it was just such like it was like innocent still but like it was just so nice and vibey like i could it was like a, a movie moment for me yeah it was cute dang we should go back to the nugget the nugget shout the out the nugget. nugget i wonder if it's still called the nugget we should just go back just walk walk the campus i've definitely thought about it Let's like just do it one i'm day. like 
why don't I just go work from Cowsey Long Beach? <laughs> I'm fucking down, dude. <laughs> why not? Make this one like short and sweet. Hopefully Sick you're not tired of us. Because <laughs> uh, I'm at the bottom of this drink now and it's hefty. Yeah, bottoms up. This is literally two ounces of Pascal. <laughs> I'm going to go eat my nuggets now. Not at the nugget. Oh, they'll still taste good. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We'll talk to you guys next week. Bye. Bye.